What is going on everybody? This is Mason and you are tuning into the YouTube channel Wasatch Pop. Guys, guess what time of the week it is? It is Tuesday, so it's time for yet another edition of Top 5 Tuesday. So, today for Top 5 Tuesday, we are going to be diving into my Top 5 Stranger Things Funko Pops. Now, I freaking love Stranger Things. Stranger Things has got to be one of my favorite shows that is on TV right now. Definitely my favorite show on Netflix. Yeah, honestly, it's like a super good show. Love it a lot. And yeah, just so many awesome references and everything in there. But we're going to review my top five Funko Pops that I've gotten from the Stranger Things show. So let's just dive right into it. Let's go. All right, guys. So coming in at number five, this one is a Hot Topic exclusive. Came out with, I think, it, I believe it was the third wave. Whatever wave it was for season two, and it is Max, Mad Max in her Halloween costume. Reason why this one is in the number five, tons of awesome little cool details to it and everything. I um, mean, she's got the Michael Myers mask on, she's got the little pumpkin, trick or treat pumpkin, she's got the little knife and everything too. So just tons of wicked cool detail. Yeah, definitely comes in at my number five spot just because of all the little things that they added on to it, just to make it so. It was just a good reference to the show and everything. So yeah, number five, Max in costume. Okay guys, and then coming in at number four, this one is a chase. I didn't get it super long ago, probably about a month or so ago. Um, and one of my friends actually helped me out on this one and it is the Dart Chase. Now, I'm honestly, one of my goals in mind is to get every single Stranger Things chase that I can. As of right now, I have them all, so there's a couple of them that are in here into the top five, but this one's really cool. If you guys have seen season two, Dart is a Dustin, one of Dustin's best buddies, but it, interesting character nonetheless. He's basically like a mini Demogorgon. Um, but yeah, this one's really cool. Probably the best one is the one with his open mouth. I didn't have this one, but definitely is an awesome chase. And yeah, coming in at number four is the Chase Dart. All right, guys, and then coming in at number three, this one was, I think, I believe it was one of the first Stranger Things ones that I had. It was in the first Stranger Things video that I made, um, and it is the Chase Demogorgon. Now, this guy, woo, he is super awesome. Pretty similar to the dart. He's got the closed mouth and everything. Definitely love all the different details that they have on it. They recently came out with like, like a six inch Demogorgon. That was really cool as well. Um, but yeah, I love this. I absolutely love this Chase. Part of it was the reason that I found it. Um, it was at that Target and I asked an employee to find it in the back for me, which was pretty dang cool. Um, and yeah, this is definitely an awesome pop. And yeah, coming in at number three is the Chase Demogorgon. All right, guys, and then coming in at number two, this is yet another Chase and it is the Chase 11 with Egos. Now, the reason this is at my number two spot is this was the first ever Funko Pop Chase that I found in the wild. It was actually at a Barnes and Noble and it was on the hashtag Lucky Cart. If you guys don't know what that is, Lucky Cart always comes in clutch. Uh, but either way, this chase is wicked awesome. I love how they put the little blonde wig on her and everything. Cause that was, I think that was a big staple of the show. It was her in disguise and everything, but definitely one of my favorite chases of all time. Definitely think they did a really good job of capturing the character in this pop. So yeah, coming in at number two is the chase 11 with Egos. And coming in at number one. Now this isn't a chase, it is an exclusive. Exclusive to Hot Topic, just like the Max was. Um, and it is Hopper in the Biohazard suit. Now, woo, this guy, tons of really, really, really cool detail to it. And that's it, why it's in my number one spot. I love how they were able to fit a head sculpt into like that little like helmet and everything. I think they did a really good job on that. He's got his little gun. If you take it kind of out of the box, he's got a little tube hooked up to his suit and to the mask. And honestly, just really, this is towards the end of season one. And I think they totally encapsulated that scene in this pop right here. So just because of all the awesome details and all the things that they were able to do with this pop, it's just it's just different from a lot of other ones. But yeah, coming in at number one is the hopper in the biohazard suit. All right, guys, and that is gonna do it for my top five Stranger Things Funko Pops. Let me know in the comments below what are some of your favorite Stranger Things Funko Pops. Maybe it was some of these. Um, honestly, there's a couple of them that I still wanna see if I can find that would definitely be added to my top five if I had them. One of them would be the Upside Down Will. That was the Think Geek exclusive. And the other one was the Steve from Stranger Things. And I think that was an SDCC exclusive. 
I don't know why I didn't pick it up initially, but anyways, those would be two that I'm really after that I really want to get. Those are my next two Stranger Things ones. But anyways, um, if you haven't already, be sure to give this video a big old thumbs up and as well comment down below with any other suggestions that you want to see for Top 5 Tuesday. Guys, you're super awesome. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my future videos. If you guys are interested in sending me mail, I'll have a link to my PO box up here and down below. If you guys wanna buy a shirt, a Wasatch Pop shirt or hoodie, link is in the description below as well. Guys, thanks so much for watching again. You guys are awesome. Be sure to be kind to one another and always promote positivity and I will see you in the next video.